It's a good question because, of course, in the in the uh, Christian tradition, there's a big stress on forgiveness. In Dharma, we're not quite centered like that. Let me let me explain. Actually, from beginning this time, we've inflicted suffering on others out of our uh, confusion about who we are and what the world is. Uh, our selfishness has proliferated and we've abused and mishandled, mistreated others. Um, and therefore we should develop a strong sense of regret and a strong sense of honesty and admission of the errors uh, and uh, and. Uh, yeah, damage that we've, that we've uh, of our errors and the damage that we've caused. Without this strong sense of regret, uh, the purification of these uh, non-virtuous actions is not possible. So Buddha strongly stressed confession of uh, of negative actions in order to regain the possibility uh, or to find the possibility of overcoming selfishness. We have the capability of that because no matter how many non-virtuous actions we've done, the fundamental core of our mind remains pure. So restoration to that is always possible, but it must arise out of a sincere regret and a confession. Now, to make our confession and our commitment not to repeat these errors stronger, we can call upon, of course, the, if, if you like, the power of the three jewels, the power of the deities and so on, because they represent the power of our primordially pure mind. So in resting in that, we can overcome all errors and all, and all selfishness. But it's not that we, that we um, uh, are, are, as it were, apologizing to it or, 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 or something like, like that. So, as I say, we're, we're centered differently. Dharma, the Dharma understanding of the journey upwards from negativity and non-virtuous actions is centered differently from the Christian one. So we do not ask God or the Buddha uh, or any such, uh, any, uh, anybody for forgiveness. Of course, those upon whom we, those whom we've damaged, uh, uh, those whom we've abused, we must try to rest, rest to, to restore uh, a, a good relationship with them by, by seeking where possible, seeking them out, and acting positively, and giving something, and and working for them. Those who we've harmed, we have a special debt to, and we should seek to, to 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 pay off that debt by kindness and compassion. But it is not asking forgiveness in that kind of Christian sense. So let me reiterate this: our sense of our negativity and the evils we do is just as strong as any Christians might be, but we have no external deity to ask for forgiveness. Rather, we must overcome our tendency to selfishness and where we can to, as it were, work for the benefit of those we've harmed. That is our duty as Buddhists.